Hello guys. Today we will see, how to enable, node scope mode NDMP protocol, in clustered mode NetApp, data on debate. Node scope mode NDMP, is usually used in cluster mode NetApp, when backup application, does not support CAB, that is cluster aware backup. In node scope mode, NDMP backup application, has to connect to each node of the cluster, through a lift which has been, created over a home port of that node. Hence few of the steps, needs to be repeated in each node of the cluster. First log into the cluster, using cluster management IP. Then in order to see, the status of the node scope mode NDMP, execute the command as shown in the video. As the NDMP node scope mode is disabled, we need to enable it to proceed further. Type the command, as shown in the video to enable, NDMP node scope mode. After enabling NDMP node scope mode, Verify the NDMP services status, by using status and show command, as shown in the video. Show command output consists of four column. First column shows, the number of node present in the cluster. Second column shows, if NDMP service is enabled, in each node of the cluster or not. Third column shows, the type of authentication, that NDMP service is going to use, for communication with backup application. Clear text true, indicates plain text or MD5 authentication type. Clear text false, indicates challenge authentication type. Fourth column shows, the user ID of the NDMP service. In cluster mode NetApp, root is the default user for NDMP service, which can be changed to any convenient user ID. Now to enable the NDMP services, and generate password for the NDMP services, execute the commands as shown. Here the NDMP services is enabled, with authentication type plain text, and user ID as NDMP. Same steps needs to be performed in each node of the cluster as shown. Once the steps are completed, in each node of the cluster, verify again with NDMP status and show commands. Output of NDMP show commands, shows that NDMP services has been enabled, in each node of the cluster, with authentication type as plain text, and user ID as NDMP. Thanks for watching. Please comment or suggest, any info on this topic. Subscribe and stay tuned for more videos.